my phone rang and I picked up my phone and it was Auntie Mary Mary Penfong. They come out to Okia Auntie. Auntie Pehana Kwe, they come in my auntie. Peter Lucas, he had now the quarter of Kakwe, hired my Kitaku Fadi. Taku Fadi, he put in me. He had now the quarter of Kakwe. They come out to Kapai, Auntie Kahara to Okia Kwe, Atea Hiahine, Memaya, Kapai, Kakita Atea Hiahi. And so then I went up to see Auntie Mary Mary Penfong and she said, Let's get digital. Let's get digital with the mahi that we do for our iwi media. This is one of our aunties who's in her 90s talking about digital innovation. And so a lot of people think that our old people aren't thinking about the future. Well, my experience with our kuya and kaumatua has been quite the contrary. Our kuya and kaumatua were the ones that encouraged our reo irirangi Māori, me as the CEO, to ensure that we had a digital future. Because that is where our people are gathering today. And if we can't meet them where they have their hui, then we, may, we might as well turn off the lights and close the door and get on with it. So when I think about the way I was encouraged to make decisions in my mahi, I have to say that she encouraged me to call a huia iwi. Now, when you have huia iwi, sometimes you don't get a lot of people come to the hui. Auntie said to me, just call the meeting. So I rang up to Uncle Hector. I said, Uncle Hector, e he he ana anti meri meri kia huia tu tato ki te marae i mahi maru. Mo te kau papa o te reo i rangi o te hiku o te ika. Te ka me mai karanga hia te hui. So I said, okay, we're having this hui. I was thinking, how are we going to get everyone there? Because a lot of people don't come to the marae hui sometimes. And so then I talked to my other auntie, and she goes, tell them they're not invited. Tell them they are not allowed to come to the hui. They come out to Okiarato. Kahore e rahui tiana te ne hui mote hunga i tupu moiro tu ite reo Maori. Monga kuya menga kau matua. Kauto kairaro iho ite fitu te kau. Tau te kau matua tanga. Koreo tia kauto te hai mai. We had the biggest turnout at that hui that you, I cannot believe it. We had so many people come to our hui because they were not allowed to come. And so I think sometimes our kuya and kaumatua have some amazing ideas to get the job done. And at that time, the kuya and kaumatua wanted to hold a hui, this was in 2013, and that was to move resolutions. And um, on the marae, it's called a motini. When no, i hiehia ngā kuia me ngā kaumātua ki te whakatūturu i ngā motini mo te anga whakamua. And so we had three motions that were moved, seconded and carried at our huia iwi about our reo irirangi Māori. One was to ensure that our reo had a digital future one was to breathe life into our archives. We have a very rich archive of Māori language and also kaupapa Māori that has been articulated in Te Reo Pākehā. And so we got the okay or the thumbs up to move forward with that kaupapa and that has influenced the way that we make decisions because we knew that we had the support of the people. And the people that we really wanted to work with were our old people and our rangatahi.